Boing! Boing! Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the ultimate build guru in this bitch. Now look, listen, 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 listen. Do not skip this video. I'm going to be giving y'all a lot of information. I'm going to be showing you the two best pure yellow playmaker, slash and playmaker, whatever you want, an offensive initiator, whatever, the best builds in the game. The best 3v3 version and the best 2v2 version, okay? I went over this extensive hours, so watch this full with no skips. First build I'ma show, okay? First build I'ma show. I'm telling you, guys, you have to watch. If you wanna learn how to make builds, the best so you don't waste your money and you're not out here getting killed on the court and then ld said they buffing ankle breakers and you know so this is the perfect time to show these builds okay i've been getting spammed on how to make these iso god builds okay now look listen the first build i'm gonna show is four 2v2s you can use it on the 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 threes pro-am you know all that but this is four 2v2 to dominate on the twos you're gonna have a 99 speed over and you're just gonna be a god max wingspan okay 99 speed max wingspan for the 3v3 build you're gonna have a shoot and takeover 99 speed man it, it, it don't even matter now look for the position i see you dumb niggas making your your pure plays at small forwards shooting guards all this stupid shit right you're dumb okay stop if you only if you care about names and shit these are the best versions you have to make them at point guard you get the most badges you get what 20 or 10 attributes by making them others but then you lose like three sometimes four badges what's the point what is the point badges are better than than attributes bro 10 extra attributes that's nothing bro uh, and you can basically make the same virtual the same builds if you just put the same weight and height and it's similar but for this side you get better badges more badges okay don't be dumb okay so we're gonna make a pg this is a 2v2 hand don't matter we're going 24 for kobe drop drop a like for kobe wait hold on hold on, hold on. before we before we go deeper into the vid make sure you subscribe if you new. 300k on the way hit that like button if you hope they break ankle breakers and turn on post notice my boy L listen up man it help me get it recommended man y'all y'all like the video it helps me out tremendously man <clears throat> so we're going to go with the pure yellow pie chart for this 2v2 build right now look you can't go with the vertical unless you don't care about 99 speed and 99 acceleration you have to pick the first one so you could play around with your height more and your wingspan more and stuff like that so you could you could go with this, you know, but you can't get 99 speed, 99 acceleration. That do be mattering in, in your speeds. Like, it's it's weird. Like, when you reach 99 with the gym rat and all that and your acceleration and stuff. I, I don't know. It's, it's weird. It's weird. So, go this pie chart. This is the best one, I think, overall for, for what you're picking this build for, right? So... Okay, so now this is the 2v2 build, right? Now you have to make it like this to get lock takeover. I don't know why. I think it's because you have max block. I mean, if you just have it with eight defensive badges and then 30 um, playmaking, which I want to do, the, the other build's gonna have 30 playmaking. And I'm gonna tell you why 30 playmaking, as many playmaking badges as needed. I'm gonna tell you why, bro. There's a lot of interesting things in this game. But to unlock block, you 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 gotta have it max, or maybe it's the 26 playmaking. I don't know what it is, but yeah, keep in mind, you know, you're shooting. If you're not too good, bro, keep in mind, bro. If you're not too good and you can't hit with a 75-3. You might want to stray away from this build. I believe they're eventually going to make it to where everyone can shoot and stuff like that. So this is a risky build. It's it's a risky build because everyone's play shots and all that. Nobody can shoot right now. But I think people are able to shoot with Hot Zone Hunter and all that other stuff. I don't know. I see, 
I see idiots asking me, what do y'all think about my playmaker, my pure yellow, and they have one finishing. Listen, listen, you idiots. Listen, dumb niggas. Stop making builds with one finishing. Paint defense is buffed. If you're an ISO god, why are you making builds with one finishing? We just don't shoot threes, especially on a playmaker. Why are you making them with one finishing? If you play someone as good as you, you're getting destroyed. If you play a lock, you're getting destroyed. That's so dumb. Paint defense is buffed. Fancy footwork is nerfed. Why are you making builds with one finishing? I don't understand. So stupid. Stop. 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 I don't, I don't get it. Stop. Stop. Okay? You need the playmaking. There's a lot of badges. You want to get ankle breakers and stuff once they buff it. And yeah, man, you got your interior. You need your interior maxed on builds that you're going to play defense on. Very, very, very important, man. And your block max. So with max wingspan, you will get hella blocks, all that. 99 speed, 99 acceleration. You got eight defensive badges. That's good enough. You don't need the 10 or 9 or more. You can, you know, even, even young Ticino be playing with, with, with six badges. So with a 6-3. So it's possible, bro. Just get your game up. You're going to be 99 speed, uh, 99 acceleration, lock takeover, eight defensive badges. You know? Come on, man. You 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 can do it. You can play D. Make them burly. It's going to make you appear even bigger than 6-6. Six, six. You know, more for defense, etc. You're going to go 6-6. Six, 6-7, six. Six, you're not going to have the 99 speed, 99 acceleration. I think that's very important. And then your shooting goes down even less if you go 6-7 and stuff like that. So you're already making a build that struggles to shoot. Why go down even more? You know, dumb to me. I don't know. But, you know, you, you do get some benefits. But I would just go 6-6. Six, six. You're already going to go max wingspan, bro. You're going to be bigger than most people on the court. Now you're going to go lowest weight. You have to go lowest weight to get your max speed benefits. Max wingspan. Uh... You can do, I think, right here. Let me see. Yeah, you can do right here. See? You can go right here and then get lock and shot. But you go max, you unlock all of them. Now look, listen very closely. Listen very closely to me. This is very important for this build. This takeover on this build is probably like the most important, bro. Now look. You're not going to want to go playmaking, okay? Man, it's been years. Playmaking takeover ain't been good since 2K17, bro. Come on, man. Let, let, let's keep it 100, bro. They keep fucking with us. They keep saying they're going to fix it. All this other stuff. They haven't did it. It's, it's time for all of us to go comp, man. If we can't break ankles with, with three different ankle breaker badges, tight handles, space creator, all that other stuff... It's not meant to be, bro. It's not meant to be. We got to have all those badges on and play tape. It's not meant to be, bro. Now, look, you could go lock or shot. These are the two I'm suggesting. Now, look, if you're not good at the game, if you're a casual, if you're not too good, but you want to be different, you don't want to be a play shot, I would pick shot creating takeover because you're already making a build that struggles to shoot, right? This will help you boost your shot, and then it also helps you get ankle breakers. You can still get ankle breakers. Stay too, too, true to your build. You can still get ankle breakers. You're going to be able to fade. You're going to be able to shoot better, right? And you're going to be able to dunk. This is the all-around, and it's the fastest takeover to get, right? So I would say for 90% of y'all, I would go shot creator takeover, right? For the other ones, the other ones that are going to grind the game, you know, you you think you're good. You're good at the game. You know you're going to get shooting down. Go lock takeover, right? You got eight. You got 99 speed, 99 acceleration. You got max wingspan. You're 6'6". Six, six. You really want to dog niggas out? Make niggas scared of you? Make niggas cry because now it's a lock on the court, you know? Niggas hated two ways last year. You go lock take, bro. You feel me? Don't pick playmaking. I don't care, bro. I don't care, bro. Fuck these niggas. <laughs> and watch, watch them buff it. It is some crazy stuff. I'm just saying, bro. I still think you should go this one of these two, bro. Um, but yeah, if I was to make this build, I'm not a 2v2 player, right? So I'm not even going to make this build. When I do make this build, it'll probably be next gen. And I'm going to be making the 3v3 version 
most likely because that's what i play i'm i might i might i might because then it's the actual lock i i might i might go mess with the twos you feel me but i i, I don't know i don't know but yeah i i, I would do this bro because i know i'm gonna be able to shoot man you you can go shot tape man it, it's up to you okay now i'm gonna show you the uh the badges that i would select for this build and y'all just making one finishing badge like it just doesn't make sense to me make sure y'all like up the vid man like up the vid you think this this build valid man bam you could rock something like this or something like this i think this will probably be the wave right here so you actually you know you got some finishing badges bro for your shooting you got all your main badges right here bro you can rock this you can rock something like this i don't know if unpluckable is, is is good but look you get hall of fame floor and dimer and you still gonna have time for you know hopefully this is buffed i i haven't really tested it probably not if it's not you can rock it on silver bronze i don't know um and yeah you can rock one of the the badges bro i, I think this is the way when you're driving this shit, you're gonna be able to pass out of it yeah man you could do something like this right with your eight badges i'll pick something like this or maybe um if rim protector bronze is good enough you could do this or something like this you got your block up you got max wingspan you know test it out bro but um if you need gold you probably have to do this but who knows i would i would test this out first and then see if you could get away with bronze and then do this you feel me see if that helps if it don't you know you're struggling with screens this this or this is probably going to be be the wave right so you know i don't know now i'm finna show y'all the 3v3 build right the 3v3 pro-am build etc i believe this is the best to make okay for 3v3 pro-am and pro-am you're gonna make you're gonna make him a point guard right say it again for y'all niggas that skip y'all need to be stop skipping my videos i said a lot of information before i made this this uh this version of the build bro but you're gonna want to go point guard it's how you get the most badges the best stats all that other stuff you go shooting guard or small forward you're going to <laughs> miss out on badge points bro and for for 10 20 attributes so stupid okay pure yellow pie you have to go this physical profile so you can have 99 speed and 99 acceleration okay Okay, this is what you're gonna go for 3v3. You're gonna be guarding corner. This is not to guard builds and all that. You're gonna be good, right? You have finishing, you need finishing. They buff paint defense. Why aren't you picking finishing? Fancy footwork is gone. Why are you making an ISO build without finishing? Doesn't make sense, my nigga, okay? You get 16 shooting badges, so you gonna have over an 83 gonna have over an 80 well, what, am, what am i hold on hold on let, let, let me show you let me show you let me show you okay you're gonna want to go burly it's gonna make you appear even bigger than what you're going to be and you're going to be 6'6 six, six. you're gonna look 6'8 right okay you're gonna make them 6'6 six, six. you still get your 99 both you gotta go lowest weight and look your wingspan right here you're going to go lowest wingspan okay now you're gonna be able to shoot, you're gonna have an 83 ball once you get 99, 87 mid range. You feel me? If you, if you, see look, if you struggle with shooting at this build, you know, you're gonna have an 87 mid range, you're gonna be able to fade from the midi. You got an 87 mid range. Most likely you could have someone with floor general, so you're gonna have an 87 mid range over an 83, 16 shooting badges, right? 16 shooting badges, right? 16 shooting badges right gonna we'll have all this playmaking ld said they buff an ankle breaker you got six finishing badges you feel me this could be a very vital build you know it, it could it could it could it could become something on god right so look listen since you're struggling with shooting fuck playmaker takeover nigga fuck this shit fuck slasher takeover too nigga listen <laughs> listen you're gonna go shot creator since everyone's struggling all that and everyone all the play shot stuff listen this is the quickest takeover to get 
you still can stay true to your ankle breaking shit, right? You know, you could probably do spin moves and get the ankle breakers like like Young Ticino and all that little cheese. It, this this boosts your dunk. It it overall boosts everything more evenly offensively. You're gonna be able to fade, take more middies. You know, when you're struggling with shooting, and it boosts the three point. You know, it you're gonna be able to fade. Okay, build up quick. You get this takeover faster than than the other takeover. I'm, I'm pretty sure unless they switch up something with slasher. But yeah, for this build, I would say fuck it and go shot shot creator takeover, bro. You feel me? And bam, you're a slasher playmaker. I know niggas is making offensive initiators. Uh, it's just slight things. They're making worse builds than what, what I'm showing you right now. It's a it's a worse build. Okay. Um, when someone makes a unique name, it's a worse version than the names you're used to. Just always remember that, bro. But I know some of y'all care about you. You just want to be a different name, I guess. I don't know. I play games to win, personally. Hey, make sure y'all like up the vid, man. Support your boy. I'd rock this on the finishing. You could rock something like this, you know, or clutch shooter, flexible release. You feel me? You got options, my boy. You got options, my boy. Get your first shot, you know, up to you, man. 30 playmaking. So you feel me? You feel me? You know, if I'm pluckable, not working like that, you know, you can get this on Hall of Fame, bro. Help your teammates out. You got Space Creator and Ankle Breaker. Ultimate highlight clip build. You feel me? That every time you drive, it don't work. You throw that bitch out and you good. You feel me? And niggas, you know, your, your daughter's going to be hitting more. Hey, you want to be different? This seems like a build that'll be able to shoot once you get all your hot spots and all that other stuff. But yeah, man, these are the two builds I would make. This this is the build I would most likely end up making. Okay? Um, but yeah, man, I hope you niggas enjoyed the video. Make sure y'all subscribe if you're new. Like the video. Turn on post notice. Sub to my second channel. Follow me on Twitch. Everything in the description. Follow me on Twitter. Go watch my other build videos. Hey, I dropped a dribble tutorial with the best signature styles for comp players. Y'all check that out. And I also broke <laughs> broke NBA 2K21 and I showed y'all some broken badges in the game that needs to be patched immediately. And um, yeah, go check those videos out. I'm out this hole, bruh.